Snow falling much I don't feel dark I'm in love even when the sun is out On a holiday Look, I don't know. He didn't explain. There was a problem with the electrical system at the nightclub. I don't know, but we may have to cancel the party. Somebody has to tell Margarita immediately. No, no, no. They're waiting for the electrician. I'm out walking. I'm meeting Francesca. We've got to study for an exam together. Sure, I can let Margarita know. Yes, yes, if I find her. Yes, of course. Relax, I'll tell her. Hi, Marco. Sorry, I'm late. Wait a minute, I'm on the phone. Yes, okay, all right. Hello? I can't hear you. Hello? Here we go, blocked again. What's happened this time? Today everything's happening to me. I can't lose this job. Oh, give it a rest already. It's important. It already stopped working a couple of days ago, suddenly. And a strange icon comes up, something like a pumpkin head with two antennas and a square tongue. Nothing. It doesn't work. Maybe the battery's just dead. No way. I left it plugged in all night. It consumes more than an SUV. You know, smartphones consume a lot, and without energy, everything stops. Especially your mobile. Let's go. We need energy to live and to do the things we like. Think how so many people in the world don't even have lights, not to mention a mobile. They need energy, too. Nice speech. But in the meantime, how do I call Margarita? Okay. Apparently, there's something that doesn't work in the system. Exactly, because it's a very complicated and complex system made of machines and computers. Yeah, and people, each with needs and interests. But now I absolutely have to talk with Margarita or I'll lose the job, the party. And the energy has its laws of production and consumption. And its costs, starting with pollution. And what do we do then? It doesn't seem to me that there's an alternative. We need energy, and without it, everything stops, just like you said. Yeah, in fact, I think we need to find a way to produce energy without polluting and without leaving anyone in the dark. Right, and how do we not pollute? For example, what do we do with all the CO2, the carbon dioxide that we keep putting into the atmosphere? Do we make it disappear? Do we send it back into the smokestacks of the factories that produced it? Actually, you're getting close. You know, I've discovered that they're developing a technology to capture CO2. And how do they do it? They told me that the carbon that gets extracted in the form of petroleum, gas or coal, when it's released with burning and transforms into CO2, it can be captured and pumped underground, really deep. It's like a round-trip cycle. It returns to the old deposit as carbon dioxide, and this is what they call geological storage. Get real. Did you dream this up? No, it's called CCS, which means Carbon Dioxide Capture and Storage. The capture and storage of CO2. They say that it can act as a bridge towards a new reality. Try and imagine. Before the bridge, the factories with smokestacks. After the bridge, without smokestacks. Cool, but how does it work? There are three main steps. First, the CO2 is captured. Then it's transported in pipelines or ships. And finally, it's stored in porous rocks to isolate and safely trap the CO2 emissions in the deep underground for thousands of years. Has this thing been tried yet? Of course. They're already doing it in some countries, in Norway, under the seafloor, in Canada, in the United States. They inject the CO2 in geological traps. That's what they're called. In the pores of the rock that absorb it more or less like a sponge. Sounds complicated. Sure. But think, in this way, we can do something about the huge amounts of CO2 that now, every day, gets put in the air by the power plants and factories. So doing just that by itself would be enough to change our lives? <laughs> just that, no. However, together with other technologies, it can help to transform the way to produce and consume energy. And thus maybe something can change in the world. And so from a dead phone, we discuss the entire system. But maybe that's right, because we're all interconnected. I always say that. Yeah, we're all connected. And I'm always more convinced that each of us has a role to play to improve these complex mechanisms. Right, I never thought about it before. Maybe because I thought that it didn't concern me. Having energy was a given. Easy. Just push a button, bam, and there it is. Instead, maybe it's time that I start to think, and not just me. What do you think, Francesca? I think that your mobile is working again. And I think that you got a message. It'll be Margarita. 
that they dream. Tall lady and a brown man walking down the street. Came in and have an old shower. For what I know, we need to change the impact of the economy. Trees have always more answer than how many you can imagine. Take me today and I won't stay The thoughts that I'm wasting my time